What's going on, guys? Welcome to another Dominaria draft back on uh, Pokemon.com slash Turtles. And now I got either, I think it's one of these two. I don't know which, though. I don't know which, though. That's it. I'm subbing. Someone tell me how. Tom, there's a button right at the top. You click it. It's right over there. I don't know how to get to it, but... I do like Squee for the Jaya Zimulating Inferno. I feel like that's actually exactly what we want to do. <sighs> Squee's also actually really good in this format. Uh, as far as my experience goes. Because he's very problematic. He's very hard to deal with. Oh, a Clifftop Retreat. And a Valduck. I'm going to go with this Valduck, I think. That's another legend. So this Dry Zimbledding Inferno is on point at the moment. Plus Valduck's a build around, which is nice to get second pick. I long for the day where my nose doesn't itch. One day. I watched Martin Jesus play Black Light Control twice in the Grand Prix, and I think in both matches, a squee out of the side or just wreck that deck. Well, I mean, are we talking about we're talking about constructed, right? Because in that case, can't you just seal it away? Oh, you can cast it from exile. Yeah, how the hell do you deal with this card? Can't you just seal it away? Ugh, no, that doesn't do that doesn't do anything that you want it to do. Well, since you know. Since I, don't, I clearly don't know how Squee works. Sorry, I, I just think I'm too stupid to understand this. That's that's basically how that works. Uh, Gideon's Reproach? Probably. Could be Elfheim Druid. Elfheim Druid's very good, but I don't know if green red is really a thing that we care about. If we take the Reproach, we actually can get the, uh, the dubs and the things. <clears throat> what up, Moonlight? Oh, believe me, it's it's higher than my my Karn count as well. I'll take the approach. I think it's probably the best. What up, Josh? Green red kicker is a real deck, huh? Is it? Is it though? I want to take the approach. That's solid removal. That's where I want to be. Oh, see, look, we could have been kicking this. Unbelievable. This pack's pretty rough. I feel like Mammoth Spider is actually the best card in this pack. Josh, I have not had a chance to take a look at the deck you sent me yet. I think you sent it... Yeah, you only sent it like four hours ago. Uh... I guess it just adamant will, like if we're sticking on theme... Could be Candle. Yeah, I'll take the Candle. Oh, a Lich's Mastery. Oh, there we go. Tiana is actually exactly what we wanted with the Valduck in the deck and uh, Gideon's Reproach. Uh, Hopefully this Lance comes back. Or a Dub. Or a Chronicler. Any one of these cards coming back would be great. Josh, have a good night, buddy. Thank you for popping in. Is this a deck where we actually care about Tragic Poet? Maybe. I mean, it's either Tragic Poet or Elephant. I don't think I like Poet, though. Eh. I like Elephant better than Poet. At least we know we can get a Blood Tallow Candle back. I have no idea if we're getting anything back with a, with a Poet. What could I have done in the last four hours? Um, I watched some episodes of Atlanta. I watched... Uh, I did some stream things. I made some more green screen memes. And I ate some Chipotle. And... Took care of a bunch of eBay stuff, I think. That was pretty much it. 
It felt productive, though, and that's the important part. Well, boy, these packs are bad. Um, I don't really care about Guardians. People still use eBay? Yes, blood. Well, millions and millions of people still use eBay. Last day in the hospital? Oh, sick, man. Congrats. Actually, Moonlight. Uh, not man, but ma'am? <laughs> What's the... I just don't know what the female equivalent of that is. I'll take Partic Wander, whatever. That pack's terrible. And I'll take Goblin. Uh, I actually have consistently gotten new things off of Amazon for... Or for off of eBay for cheaper than Amazon. I think that's why you can get things for cheaper on eBay because people actually don't check there. They just go to Amazon by default and uh, you're missing out on all of these significant things that you can get on eBay for less than Amazon prices. Uh, in addition, additionally, um, I also get a lot of comics that I can't get on eBay or on Amazon through eBay and vice versa. I sell them there as well because you can't sell them on Amazon. I mean, you could, but it's not going to go very well. I'm not thrilled about this deck yet, but congrats, Moonlight. Congrats. Wow, just yesterday you had your second son. That is very recent. <laughs> it's, like, it's not like a week ago, not like last month. Literally yesterday. Eh, I'll take the rare. All right, I'll take the Sorcerer's Wand. All right, I'll take the Compass. All of these, all these picks are bad. Well, you know what they say: once you cast the second sun, you win the game. So that's good. So congrats on winning the game. Isolated Chappy. Wow, this pack is also terrible. Jeez. And <laughs> I did win the game. Nice. Congrats. Oh, a meander a mending of Dominaria. Well. God, this is good. This is good. This is good. I guess we'll just take Sergeant here. I wonder if we're going to get any equipments or enchantments for this equipment enchantment deck. Nothing yet. Fire Intervention is probably better than Surveyor and Invoke. But probably it is, but those other cards are also very good. Yeah, these packs have not seemed very good. Our deck is kind of a... Well, it's not great. Let's put it that way. I just take Radiant Lightning here just to have a... Uh, just to have it. It's probably Kelden Raider, right? I mean, Radiant Lightning is real good. It just wins games sometimes. Got to take the main deck card at this point, I think. I don't think we're at a point where we can just willy-nilly take some sideboard cards. Sergeant, you don't go there. You go there. Elephant, you can probably go here. You know, in case we hit that seven mana slot. I mean, getting back a glider or a blood tallow candle seems pretty likely, so... Oh boy, these packs have been something else. Like Vicious Offering is the best card in this pack, but I'm just going to take the Invoke because 
it's very good and it's in our colors. All right, this guy's fine. Oh, actually, being able to discard Squee with this guy is pretty sweet. <clears throat> you only get to do it once, though, because he doesn't go back to your hand. I've been surprised that anything is or isn't in these packs, so you are not alone there. We also don't have a single enchantment. Like, thankfully, this is just good on its own. As a 3-3 flyer with first strike for five, but I'd still really like some equipments or enchantments for our equipment slash enchantment deck. How about a... Uh, I'll take a black blade... Or I'll take a uh, Forebearer's Blade. I'll take a Helm. I'll take... What else? <laughs> That's all I can think of. What's up, Zoro? Frenzied Rage is probably my least favorite of them, but... I mean, no, I guess Dub is my least favorite. I do like equipment better than I like, um... The Enchant... Oh, actually, On Sarah's Wings is my favorite. That's probably the best one we want. So this is, what, 22 cards so far? So... I think that's it. I think we've seen this whole... Uh, probably don't want Kitty with Wings here because we're definitely not wanting to splash blue for an arcane flight. Are we still connected? <laughs> like, Did we get disconnected? I don't understand what's going on right now. Are we dead? Was it not meant to draft today? Oh, all right, we did it. Oh, short sword's actually great. All right, feels good. Perfect. <laughs> Eternity Empire, believe it or not, this is not my first draft. <laughs> That's... So we got two cards we can kick. So on turn six, this guy's getting in there for three. I don't hate the way this looks. We actually have quite a few uh, triggers for this. One, two, three, four, five. How many Bloodstone Golems do you want? I'm going to take the Voltaic Servant just for the sake of, uh, in case we open like a Traxos or something. All right, our two drop slots just got real good. You can kick all your cards. Yeah, we are doing a Jaya's Immolating Inferno here, just to be clear. I don't care about that. Ah, uh, that guy's mildly playable. Cringe. <clears throat> I actually like this deck uh, more than I expected I would. So that's good. Oh, there's the Joda. All right. Right on time. Right on time. Beautiful. Barrage is very good. Probably better than Fiery Intervention. Knight of Grace is good. So is Blessed Light. I think it's probably Barrage. Barrage. 
Static suicide? I cannot imagine you getting muted by another mod. I don't even think that's possible, right? Oh. I subscribed yesterday, and then the next day you're gone. You're like, my what? Is <laughs> I'm right here, man. Uh, it might be Blessed Light over Barrage. Yeah, it's probably Blessed Light. Oh, a Danitha. And another Goblin Barrage. Okay. Well, and another Eviscerate. Back to back Eviscerates. Yeah, definitely taking the Danitha here. Uh, Gitu Chronicler and Invoke. Don't care about any of these. Actually, it's probably Chronicler. We have Blessed Light. We have Gideon's Reproach. Or not Blessed Light. Uh, we have... Never mind. I said it correctly, and then I corrected myself for saying it incorrectly, but I actually said it correctly. I'm going to take the Chronicler. Anything we're cutting here? Nope, that's all good. This guy is not great here. You're okay. I'm actually... I like Partic Wanderer more than, more than most do, I think, because it's very big at a certain point. I think Runamux Trample is actually underrated as well. Oh, another Blessing. I will just take that. And another Eviscerate. Good lord. Someone's getting a triple Eviscerate deck. Wow, our black deck would be utterly insane. We'd have a million Vicious Offerings and a million Eviscerates. Ancient Stirring. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. This is 22 cards. We can easily cut any of these. Golem or a Banal Shiro or a Voltaic Servant. Banal Shiro is actually probably better with Nanatha and Squee and <clears throat> Val Valduck. Nope. Um, it's probably dub, surprisingly enough. Dub on a Valduck or a Tiana is pretty okay. I don't think we want a second sergeant. I don't care about Goblin War Chief. You guys don't like that Mike Big Cheer uh, emote <clears throat> gif? Oh, Isolated Chapel. We can splash this Yarl when it comes back. It's not coming back. Your Yarl isn't coming back. This is a late Time of Ice and a late Saprling Migration. I think I'm just taking Invoke here. I'd rather just have a second Invoke. Oh god, all these cards are so bad, dude. This draft is not as as planned <clears throat> I mean this is our 23 15 creatures a good amount of removal I mean it's not terrible I'll take the rare <laughs> sure Yargle B. Argle that's the name his mother gave him It's your boy Tom with the sub. Thank you so much, buddy. I really appreciate it. Oh, a Frenzied Rage. That's actually pretty okay. All right, so Radiant Lightning, we did get one. That's pretty nice. Um, we can definitely cut one of these four guys. Voltaic Servant seems bad. All right, we did it. This stream content is so lim- Ah, ha, ha, ha. Uh, Awkward. <clears throat> yeah, I actually wouldn't mind getting a second Radiant Lightning. Um, I'll just take the trick. I don't care about the random two drop. We could have taken the uh, the land, but meh.
Oh, this journey mage plays off the other journey mage. Don't care. Where's the Lyra you were supposed to open? Oh, uh, I think it's actually back with the Teferi and the Karn and the History of Benalia I've been meaning to open. Come on, guys. Let's be realistic. It takes more than 35 drafts to open one of those rares. Don't be ridiculous. Sure. Elephant number dose. This is a very easy deck to construct. 9-8. Perfect. Done. Beautiful. I just want you to know that was not simple through my phone, but it's worth it for the Itzy Boy Tom stream. Yeah, thank thankfully everyone should know that Itchy Boy Tom has sponsored this stream. Chronicler is whiz. Hmm. It's your boy, Squee. Planes. That's not a planes. Why would you... I guess you got confused. You're like, oh, white card? Okay, I'll give you that. Thanks. Well, <clears throat> not going to hold out hope for the uh, Sanctum Spirit Squee combo because I really don't want to assume I draw a white, a white mana next turn of planes, if you will. Cool. Cool game. I'm surprised they attacked there. They're like, yeah, I'll, I'll attack for, for one when you can get in for two. Oh, they 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 were they found out that's not a good deal after all. Hmm. I mean, Tiana is clearly the better value here. Never didn't have it, except for the first four turns. But other than that, I, other than those four turns, I never didn't have it. Billy! What's going on, buddy? Oh, it's old Quende. I will block your... No, I won't. That sounds terrible. I spent like three minutes trying to think of something weird to say, like I'm your cousin and can't with wow, three minutes. You're like, God, I can't just say something basic. I need to have something clever thought up here. Do you have any actual decks you own and keep together for sentimental reasons? Uh, I have the... <clears throat> for sentimental reasons, I have the two limited decks I played at the Pro Tour that I went 6-0 with. So I kept those, and I have those still sleeved. It was the Oath of Gatewatch Battle for Zendikar limited format.
That's a good block. Kill your little bird, put him in the trash can. You asked for too many lands, tell the text. Yeah, I don't understand. It's, uh... That's a good dude. Four, five, six, seven, eight, ten. Probably just take ten here. I mean, just because Mike works during the day, I can't make Mike come stream with me. Like, if he's if he's not if he's busy or if he's like like he has his own life. He's his own human being, guys. If there was an official vote in the graveyard of trash can, I would vote in favor. I think you know the answer to this, which is why you're asking. Not doing anything here. Okay, well, that's enough. Okay, that's enough. One, two, three, four. Attack with everything and we exile this guy. You're probably just dead, right? So you block here, you take 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. You go to 1. Birder, dur, birder, 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 birder. Uh, we saw one creature that gets hit with Radiant Lightning. That's pretty much it, though. I guess we can submit like this. We didn't see many invoke targets either, so I assume one is good. Well, not if you don't have any lands, it's not. We also didn't see any removal. We saw basically nothing. I wonder if they're mono white. Okay, keep. Bottom you in the hopes of hitting better, better lands. I have a life and I play MTG. You guys are my life. <clears throat> All right, take a little. I just ask because you seem to laugh and have more fun on Mike. Is I I I don't know if that's true. I I I think I have more fun when I feel validated as a human being on my own without Mike around. <laughs> that's how I feel. So like whenever someone's like, "Hey, guy, I really like your stream better when Mike's around," then I then I actually feel worse. So doesn't happen all the time but i do get comments like that i'm like god you guys are harsh yeah my life doesn't go to this school you wouldn't know nothing dang <laughs> i like billy i like you Never. Was he kidding? I don't know. Felipe's in the kitchen cooking and he's got some like big band swingy type music on. And I'm like. This guy's getting countered 1,000%. Felipe actually probably is in the kitchen cooking with onions. He's making steak and potatoes, so actually maybe not. I don't know. It's a good question, though. 
Start another channel for music. The problem with that is that it's just it'll get, you know, you'll uh, it'll all be muted on the vods and I don't know. I don't think YouTube's ready for the the sweet sounds of my the my my dulcet tones. Is this going to be a nightly sanctum spirit? That's a good question. Why do they call it dub when there's only one? These are the questions we ask ourselves. What could they have? Gideon's Reproach? I don't care about that too much. We could discard this. Seems fine. Oh, they didn't do anything. Blink of an eye? Is that a thing you care about? Probably not. Pew! Look at this life swing that's about to happen. Yeah, I'll definitely discard Candle to, to save this guy if I have to. Invoke? During the main phase? Well then. <clears throat> now I feel safer to do this. Ha-ha! Dubberino. That is one nightly spirit. That's why you don't do these things in the main phase. Then you get then you give your opponent the option to do more things. The more you know. Do, 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 do. At what time frame does it stop being a spoiler? Uh not not the first week, not the first two weeks, definitely. <clears throat> I like my 5 4 first striking a lifelinker with a indestructible clause on it. However, if they have Blessed Light or Blink, I'm going to be real sad. Same with Inbolus's clutches. Alright, here we go. Gideon's Reproach. Oh, God. Don't do it, man. Trickster. Dang. I mean, out of all the uh, out of all the answers to this guy, that is probably one of the least offensive ones. I don't think we have anything we're doing with this. Gotta be up at four AM. Good luck and be on the right time tomorrow. You poop. You can't throw it. My bad. My bad. My bad. Wait, what? Sorry, I, I just think I'm too stupid to understand this. I have no idea what just happened. What on the earth? Oh, wow, the combos! Combo's connected to the neck bone. The neck bone's connected to the combo bone. They are just taking five. I'm not sure I understand what's happening right now. I'm very confused. I don't think Idub's fan base is even like that's interesting because it's never actually even affected me. Like I've never I I have no idea who Idub's fan base even is because I don't read the YouTube comments. So like when you don't do that, I don't know how you actually know who the who are the who are his fans even. Who even are they? You got it. I'm going to kill them.
I think 20 is where we usually put the volume at. Neck bones connected to the ear bone. The ear bones connected to the chicken bone. Chicken bones connected to the turkey bone. And these are the bones in your body. Gonna kill this because it's obnoxious. Put it in the trash can. My guy's fine. Wish I had a kick spell now. Gonna attack and then you can't do nothing. Taking five and then you're basically dead. These are the rules of the road. What is he saying right now? I have no idea. I don't know if you can hear that. I have no idea what's happening out there. I'm actually terrified. Oh, they kicked it this time. Oh boy, it's kicked. You guys can hear that weirdness out there? Dude, I have no idea what that was. It was like, well, it sounded like a bunch of it sounded like a bunch of wild turkeys. Spirit bones connected to the chicken bone. These are turtles all day. Is this guy just gonna keep getting in there? I don't understand what's going on here. No blocks whatsoever. All right, I'll stay. I'll be. I'll go to thirty-six. It doesn't have flying. What's happening right now? I am the Devant Trapper. Thirty-six to four. It's like a football game, right? Those are points you can get in a football game. I don't understand football very much. I think we're going to be a folk rap singer with a jazz accompaniment. I'm okay with that. If you got a chance, listen to the song Singing Tacos. Had a four-year-old sing it all day in my class. You know, not Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll hit up some singing tacos at some point. It is Taco Tuesday after all. Oh, God. Our hand is just amazing. So I guess they just have to start chump blocking at some point. Oh my, oh wait, what? What? Why don't they block? I don't understand what just happened. I'm so confused right now. Oh, raining tacos. What did you... Oh, so it's not... Oh, it's not singing tacos. It's raining tacos. Okay. It's raining tacos. Hallelujah. It's a raining tacos. <laughs> what are you saying, Alan? What did Alan say? I literally don't see any Alan messages. Oh, you're, oh, Alan's not even in the chat, is he? You're just... Oh, he is in the chat. Oh, my God. I'm... I think I'm blacking out. I think I'm having a stroke. The strangest part of the situation where could have been equipping the shield to reduce the life gain by two per chump block. Yeah, they could have been doing a lot of things. Instead, they decided to do literal nothing, which is very strange. Yeah, the best part about going Lich's Mastery into Approach is that you draw seven from the seven life so that you automatically have Approach in your hand. Unless those triggers don't work like that. I'm too. I'm not in the position to think about how, how that's going to work out. Oh, one time. Red, red. Just red, red. One time. I hate magic. Literally hate this game. You got it. 
I would have taken any land, to be quite honest. I'm not even picky about it. Welp. Sure. Run amok. Oh, she just did. That's cool. Legends is a good game. I really enjoy it. All right, we did it, boys. Because you and me and the model makes me nice. Well, I'll take two there. I'm not going to block. I'm not going to run into your shenanigans. That's sad. <sighs> it's impossible to figure out what cards are being played? How do you mean? Like, because you don't know what the cards do? Pretty sure we just pass here. I have no desire to dub this guy. Yeah, he's really loud. Four cards in hand. Sure. Red mana. Thank you. Finally. Living the dream. Hungry Howie's for the cat. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that's. I don't know if that's adequate cat food, but you know. What do I know? God, he's so loud. It's unbelievable. No blocks. Good dude. <laughs> Kill you too. All right. Seems good. Oh, boy. I think we're just dead to flying now, but... No, we're not. We got Chronicler when we hit this one land. Nailed it. Actually, we can probably get Reproach back here, which is a little bit better for our mana. I guess we go to 8, but our hand is good. We can play both of these next turn, which is nice. Sure. Giving that guy flying. All right. Seems good. It's not what I wanted to do, actually. I just got tilted. Hmm. Well, still going to still gonna do it, I guess. Discard an actual card instead. Now nah, draw land. Yep. Fantastic. A 
I guess hope you don't have the trick. Land again. No, Sanctum Spirit. Actually, pretty good. All right. We're live. Until we're not. Which is very, very soon now. Squee one time. It's not a squee. It's your boy Tom. Have a great night, buddy. Thank you for the sub. Really appreciate it. Not an ideal attack, but Ooh, a Mesa Unicorn and dead on board unless we can find something and we cannot. All right. Oh boy. Are you lightning? Do you do anything? Not really. Against the deck full of one threes. Yeah, I don't think there's anything on our side, but it's really relevant. Hold on one second, guys. All right, I tricked the cat into thinking we were getting food, and then I just shut the door because he's way too loud. Yeah, we'll keep this hand. It's not great, but... Why did I win that game instead of losing? Um, That's a tricky question. I blame not having a, uh, any, a number of good plays for the first few turns. Uh... Yeah, here we go. Mm-hmm. This is where they play Danitha. Oh, horseman. Seems okay. That guy's really good. I don't think they're going to be blocking here. <laughs> but if they are, that's a totally fine trade. Cool. <clears throat> well, that was a fun game. Of course, they have Dry Zimbling Inferno, followed by the rare turn four legend. Why wouldn't you? Oh, good times. You're asking if we just concede to the 2-2 uh, rare legendary 1-3 Corsair while we have literally nothing in hand that deals with either of those cards? Yeah. That's not worth my time. I 
I, have, I just have no desire to limp along against that. Like, that seems unfun to me. Yeah, I mean, not gonna... J-Man, not gonna, uh... <laughs> not gonna complain about the turn 5 Emulating Inferno wiping my board after the turn 4 Legendary Bird. Seems good. How about... What do we have in our deck that we can... Short Sword would be good. Just because it doesn't actually force us to two for one ourselves. Always yield to that. Yep. Sure. Keep on pushing. Plus four, plus four, plus four. Like you do. Yargle. I'm sorry, Yargle. You have to see the light, buddy. Blinded by the light. Rubbed up like a new another runner in the night. Yeah. It's a good one. Well, we gotta play our hand now, otherwise Caligo Skin Witch makes us discarded. We can only play one thing. Blessed light off the top. Come on, one time. Oh, that's not a Caligo Skin Witch. Oh, it's just a Verdant Force, that's all. We're having a good time. Still only play one thing here. Tap down the bells and lock. Does that do anything? Hit block here, block here, take two. We lose one of our three guys. Actually, we got a squee here, which is pretty good. That is pretty okay. So they go to two now? 
They get two more guys from the Sapperling, though, which is unfortunate. If they play Skin Witch, they get one card. Squee dies, though. They have to have an answer for the flyer. Sure. You got it. Get in there, little squeed. Do your job, and next turn I'll tap your things. Well, they have three cards in hand. If they can't stop a Aesir Glider or gain life, they die. Two cards. I ain't afraid of no bells and locks. All right. That was pretty sweet. Radiant Lightning, you can definitely come in. Didn't see many invoke targets. Might just want to take the invoke out. I'll bring a run amok in. I'll take invoke out. That's how we do it. Squee. With infinite triggers. That's how you do. That's how you do it. Is that how you do it? I don't know. Sorcerer's Wand ever? Never. Maybe. Maybe. The problem is we only have like one wizard. I think this is our only wizard. <laughs> so like, I don't want to tap a guy to deal one. keep it I think squeeze should be a wizard you're right you're a wizard squee I'll block with my Lanawar Scout. This is all fine. Until they go Fungal Infection and I feel real dumb for just throwing away this guy. Sure. They're just cheating lands into play. I'm watching this Black Artifacts YouTube video on halfway through. How does it end up? I can't tell you that. That's the spoilers, buddy. <sighs> Crying out loud. Oh, you just... Casually drew four cards. Ah, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, boy. I just want to... Just want to do a thing. Having a good time. JK, no good time was had today. I mean, then we still have to find another light for Verdant Force. So, you know. Oh, 
crying out loud. <sighs> yep, one yargle down. I've come to bargle, Senor Yargle. Get in there. Do your job. I think this is a fine trade. The only problem is this guy doesn't kill Bells and Luck on his own now, so. <laughs> I like people leaving the actual streams to watch the YouTube videos. That's funny to me. All right, so there they play a forest. Yeah, I don't know about that. All I know about is these three guys. Why not? Just another manic Monday. Whoa, whoa. Wish it was Sunday. Whoa, whoa. Cause that's my fun day. Just another manic. Burk, 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 burk. Just double block with these two idiots, please. Let's do it. There you go. You figured it out. You're smart. You know how Magic the Gathering works. You're an adult. Yeah, whatever. <sighs> None of these things are end up well. Like, Bells and Locks just obnoxious at this point, but I really want to get rid of the Verdant Force. Jesus Christ. Is this for real? Is this serious? This feels like a joke. Yeah, sometimes you just have one of those days where every opponent has the nuts draw. Don't care anymore. <laughs> I'm all in. I'm all in on bloodstone goblins. Here comes Ver Verdant, Verdant Force. Well, they still have spores. They still have both of these, which is pretty ridiculous. It's okay. The next draft we do, it's gonna have both Lyra and Karn in it, just like, just like the old, uh, just like. Oh, all right. I can't even attack anymore. Yep. When they said there'd be days like this, there'd be days like just a just alpha here, please, please alpha. Just kill one of my guys in alpha. I'm at literal eleven, dude. I don't understand. Like this is such an alpha turn. You kill this guy. Sure. As soon as they play a land and they verdant forest, we're just in trouble. Why aren't they attacking? I don't understand what's happening here. Yep. Chronicler. Sergeant at arms. Block, block, block. B 
be aggressive. Be, be aggressive. Nope. There you go. You figured it out. So long, my little board. Do we have any way to beat this guy? Probably not. Man, you got the good first day at the job and the wife's... <laughs> crying out loud you gotta be kidding me so it's funny because now we can get to chronicle to get back the blessed light but by that time they'll have two verdant forces so cool all right let's bring the invoke back in Oh god, I actually want to vomit. <laughs> Quende said that be de Did Quende say that though? I have a hard time uh uh, I have a hard time believing that Quende said that. Is it in the Dominarian scriptures? You know what? Sure. This doesn't kill uh, either of your bombs, but whatever. I guess we'll deal with it. Yeah, that's why we, we brought the Radiant Lightning in. We had it's in our deck, so we just have to draw it. Wow. Caligo skin witch. <clears throat> Sometimes I go to the deli and I'm like, give me your best skin witch, good sir. And they're like, buddy, I have no idea what that is. It sounds disgusting and you're going to have to leave. And I'm like, looks like somebody got a little upset. Mama said, Mama said, Mama said, there'd be dead. I'm just going to play this guy this turn. We can keep it the run amok next turn. Yes, I will use this ability. Oh, look at that guy. Look at that gentleman. Everybody get in there. Be aggressive. Guys, be aggressive. Just be a little aggressive, that's all. Come on, make your blocks good. Block like you mean it. Block him like you mean it. Block around the world. Uh, no blocks, I'll take eight. Okay. On a scale from one to aggressive, what should we be? Uh, I'm leaning more toward the aggressive side of the scale. On the bright side, they'll have to play their bells and lock at a normal turn, like six, instead of four or five. All right, it's block time, baby. Double block one of these guys. That's what you're going to do. You're going to block with a 1-1 one, one, and a 1-3. And 
and then you're going to take six. And you're like, six is a reasonable amount to take. I feel comfortable taking six. There you go. You did it. Look at that. It's like they knew exactly what we were going to do. Another skin witch, huh? And a candle. Skin witch and a candle. Two cards that need six mana. One card that needs five mana. So I attack with this guy, you sack this dude. I don't like that. I'm just gonna pass and play Valduck. You can keep the keep the flame, buddy. The pressure's off. The pressure's off. There you go. Every game. Wouldn't be a game if you didn't have your bells unlocked. Oh, you got you drew one elf. Good for you. You gotta be gotta be kidding me. <laughs> you have to be joking. Oh, Magic the Gathering. It's a fun game. Look at our planes in our graveyard. We're going on turn three of not doing anything. Cause our hand is all five drops. All right, we need to have this guy. Oh, that's aggressive stance there. One time. Zero times. Cool. Why not? Why not? Five, seven, eight, so eleven, eleven. Yep. Hey, look at that, we did it. No, we're not doing anything here, that's for sure. Oh, radiant lightning off the top. We can go blessed to this guy, radiant lightning all your things. Oh boy. It's okay guys, our last card is Wild Onslaught. JK, JK. It's okay, they only did 12 damage to us. <laughs> it's okay, it's only 12 damage. Boom 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 ba boom ba ba boom ba boom ba 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 boom ba 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 boom boom Yep, that is a fine order. I'll pass to you, good sir. You gonna eat this guy? Whoa. Get out of town. Get out of town. No, seriously, get out of town. I don't like that guy. That guy needs to leave town. Might as well play the land. I try to avoid the two and a half men song, but it's really difficult. Oh, that's a that's a spicy meatball. That is just fine. I might just candle one of these guys, to be quite honest. But then they can candle the guy in response. I don't think that's great. Uh, we're definitely saving fire intervention because we have. I'm not. I mean, like we're we're not gonna we're not gonna use it on one of the one ones. 
So, yep, that is fine. You just take eight. You're definitely going to candle this guy. Seems good. Oof. That's actually totally fine. I, I like our hand a lot better. We get to Gitu Chronicler, they take six here. Uh, we get to get back. Always yield to these guys. I think we only have Blessed Lights in the graveyard. No, we have a run amok. So you're at four. I think we can win this game. <laughs> How nice. What can they even return? The other skin witch? Yeah, that's not a thing. Oh, that was a good draw. Yeah, that seems pretty good. That was probably the best draw we could have had there. So you gotta block double double and then so two two and one one here, and then one 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 three one one here. And you take one, you go to three, and we still got four bodies on the board. And you're probably going to sack, I don't know, two things that die. All right. Not uh, not a three zero, but a two one is still pretty good, and all of our decks, were, all of our opponents' decks, are pretty good. So uh, either way, thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons, and I'll uh, see you next time. Check out my Patreon page, patreoncom Frank Sport, and I'll see you next time.